Welcome, and thank you for purchasing a Cisco IronPort ScanSafe security product. During this video, we will take a look at some of the online resources available that can help you administer the device and answer many common questions. The information has been divided into sections for easy reference. We encourage you to follow along with the video to explore the resources. Now, let's get started. The first step in accessing the numerous resources available online is to register and create an account on Cisco.com. Once you go to Cisco.com, click on the register link at the top right, which will bring you to the registration page. Next, enter your email address and the user ID and password that you will use to access the site each time. When choosing a password, please note the password restrictions listed on the right hand side. Once that is complete, scroll down to the contact section and enter your information. This will be used by TAC engineers to reach you regarding a support case if needed. Once the contact information has been entered, scroll down and answer the two security questions and enter the security code. Next click on submit and you're done. Next we'll look at how to link your new user ID with your Cisco contract number. Now that you have created your user account, we can link it to your contract ID. To do so, log into cisco.com and click on account at the top right. Next click on go now under user profile manager. Now click on additional access and then add service contract numbers to profile. From here, enter one or more contract ID numbers that were provided to you and then click on submit. Now you can access the information and support cases related to your account. In this segment, we will look at ways to access the Cisco IronPort ScanSafe support portal. One method is to go to www.cisco.com and click on support. In the product support text box, you can enter the model number of your device, such as S360, and you will be directed to the specific technology web page. In order to access all of the information available online, the preferred method is to go to the search box at the top right and enter IronPort customer support. This will bring you to the Cisco IronPort ScanSafe support homepage. Here you can access a variety of information such as the Cisco support community, the knowledge base, user's guides, software downloads and tools, and ScanSafe and CRES information. Let's take a look at these offerings in more detail. Now we'll review how to access the user guides from the support portal. Once you are logged in to cisco.com and on the support portal site, look for the technical documentation section in the middle of the page. Select the appropriate device for which you need documentation. In this example, we will choose Web Security Appliances. Scroll to the bottom of the page and click on either Release Notes or End User Guides to view the available documentation. You will see a list of available versions. Click on the desired link and the PDF file will open. This site will be updated with documentation for any new releases of Async OS, so be sure to check back periodically. If you have a question about your Cisco IronPort device, the answer is likely in our knowledge base. This isn't just a collection of frequently asked questions, it also contains many how-to articles that will help you administer and configure your device successfully. Once you are logged into Cisco.com and on the support portal site, the knowledge base link can be found on the right side of the page. You can search by product, category, keyword, or article number. In this example, we will search on how to block an email sender. The resulting list shows the articles that match our search terms. We'll click on the first article to view the solution. At the bottom of the article, you can rate how well the article answered your question and see other related articles. Our support engineers are continuously adding new articles to the knowledge base to keep it updated with the latest information.
There are some additional tools and plug-in software that can be used with your Cisco IronPort device. To download these programs, go to the Cisco IronPort ScanSafe support portal and log in. For this video, we will choose the Email Security Appliance. Near the bottom of the page, click on Download Software. On the next page, choose the model of the device you have. You'll now see a list of available software to download. You can choose to download now or add it to your cart if you have multiple items to download. Next, we'll look at the available software for the web security appliance. Once you have selected the device model, you can download the Sawmill or Splunk reporting software. These software downloads can help extend the functionality of your Cisco IronPort device. The Cisco Support Community is a place where users and support engineers come together to share knowledge and offer advice. It is located at supportforums.cisco.com and uses your cisco.com login ID to access the features of the site. Once you are logged in, click on Ironport under the Security section to access the related content. Here you will find links to the user discussion forums, support blogs, and knowledge base videos created by our support engineers. Let's take a look at the Email Security User Forum. Here you will see the ID of the user and the subject of their discussion, as well as how many views and replies there have been. Once you click on the subject, the full discussion thread will come up for your review. You can also rate the answers on the thread. Next we'll review the knowledge base videos. These videos are created by our support staff to help guide you through common configuration and administrative tasks. There are a variety of topics available for both the email and web security appliances. The support engineers are continuing to create new videos as a result of the great response from our customers. Thank you for watching this video showing the many resources available on the Cisco IronPort ScanSafe support portal. We hope these will be valuable tools as you configure and administer your new device. Thank you and have a great day.